All right, what's up you guys? Here at 3 100 here today. Uh, I woke up this morning uh, having some jailbreaking feelings. Um, my iPhone is no longer jailbroken for the record and my iPad is no longer jailbroken and they are on 6.1.2 each. I updated over the air and I'm gonna be jailbreaking them. I'm gonna, just gonna be jailbreaking the iPad for today. So uh, let's do this. I have Evasion running on my MacBook. If I can focus on that. Uh, I have it running on there. And right here I have the uh, iPad 2, uh, 16 gig, about 5 gigs free. Uh, and I'm just doing this video hopefully to show that this has been updated over the air and uh, it hasn't been fully restored, but it can still be done. So, just plugging it in here. It's plugged in. It's got about 5 to 6 gigs free. And so it says uh, device has a passcode set, so let's disable it. So I'm just uh, turning out the pa turning off the password. All right, so no password is on. I know it doesn't focus right when it's really bright, but it, you don't really need to see. It. So on the computer, let's do this. Uh, it's just to uh, plug it back in. Is what I did. Now let's just take a focus on the screen, and then I'll focus as uh, as it's doing. So I'm on the screen here, it says uh, "Welcome." It says "Welcome." Evasion is an untethered jailbreak for iOS 6.0 to iOS 6.1.2. iPad 2 Wi-Fi revision 2 is supported. Click jailbreak to begin. So uh, I'm gonna click jailbreak. Got a message on my phone. Retrieving information uh, from the device to generate jailbreak data. Now from what I hear, this is a speedier process than all the other jailbreaks, but I mean, it still takes time to um, negotiate with the device, put in Cydia, find out some cracks in the code. So uh, it's obviously gonna take a little bit longer than about five to 10 minutes. So I hope that this uh, runs fast. My MacBook, um, it's a pretty low spec MacBook. But it's the MacBook that got discontinued, just for the record, just to show you. Uh, a lot of people on YouTube are using like iMac's latest generation uh, and like the iPad latest generation, 64 gig, 128 gigs. But I mean, here I am just using stuff that anybody else would have. But yeah. So what I know from this is not to touch the iPad at any time during the jailbreak. Uh, from watching a couple videos on YouTube, I just learned that um, you should just pay attention to the software and not think, okay, I should do this, this, and this. I remember when I jailbroke on uh, iOS 5 point something, untethered, that uh, you would have to manually hold the um, lock button and the uh, home button to make it force reset and then just uh, wait for the jailbreak to finish. I was lucky that that worked, but you shouldn't really be playing around with this stuff and you don't want to make your iPad or iPhone or any other iDevice a paperweight because they're really valuable. Anyway, we're just waiting. Uh, nothing going on with the iPad. It's kind of there. I don't know why the fingerprints are looking up on the screen. In real life, you can't see anything. And the reason I am jailbreaking, I know a lot of people uh, don't say the reasons, but it's not to get like free apps because I know Installulus kind of went away. But uh, the reason I am jailbreaking is because I want to have a lot more features than uh, iOS 6 kind of kills you off on. Now, um, some of those features, uh, like a bunch of springboard mods, uh, uh, themes, themes are really nice. All right, so here we are injecting stage one jailbreak data just popped up about five minutes into the or four and a half minutes into the video waiting for a device to reboot the iPad uh, shows uh, the little Apple logo do not touch your device it says on the screen turn down the brightness there just to get a balanced uh, visual around the room zoom out maybe we can get both of them in there at the same time
just make this a little better prop it up ah it sucks that case is wearing out all right so that's showing there on the screen what we're getting is uh, preparing stage two jailbreak data uh, step one of three do not touch your device I'm just trying to get the best of uh, what I can here get everything uh, in the frame says uploading city of packages list do not touch your device I'm trying to find a nice uh, brightness so they both fit on the screen let's take a more focus on the MacBook it says right here to continue please unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon only tap it once the screen will go black then return to the home screen so on the iPad let's focus let's focus clearly on it I don't want to mess around so here's the iPad I don't know why the home button doesn't respond but um unlock it scroll over here we have a jailbreak app tap it it's gonna crash and it's going to return to home screen injecting remount payload it says root file system preparing jailbreak data Injecting real jailbreak data or final sorry couldn't read that on the camera Jailbreak complete the device may restart a few times as it completes the process so now we're just going to focus on the device the iPad And I'm not going to disconnect it or anything And again just a couple of specs on the iPad 16 gigabyte black um, revision 2 of the iPad and uh, updated over the air and not wiped it has all the original applications all the original music I haven't restored or backed up so right here it's a, uh, setting up Cydia packages has the nice logo another Apple logo appears restarting Uh, and the analyzing offsets kind of fades uh, to gray and black finding offsets cleaning up done continuing boot uh, Still not disconnected still haven't closed the program And uh, there we are so wallpaper all that's there now um, to make sure, excuse me, to make sure uh, everything is just where it was, all the music should be there, all my music is still here, nice hero temptations, uh, whatever, but all my music is still there, everything is still there, um, mailbox setup still there, everything is there, so you don't need to... Uh, do everything that they say although it is recommended I just did it in front of you guys in under about 10 minutes uh, now all we got to do is set up Cydia it takes a couple seconds or a couple minutes and from what I know this is the new Cydia the Cydia is um, has been updated and uh, I hear that it's way better with performance and a bunch of things I've been hearing about it anyway I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'm gonna start making more jailbreak videos now uh, more jailbreak tutorials I know I have some up they're not the best in my opinion but I tried my best which is I guess what matters it helps out people but uh, again thank you guys for watching Hugo 33100 here today and as always like comment and subscribe for more videos again it means a lot thank you guys for watching and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video